what I'm standing in here is two different varieties of crimson blue. Uh, to my left here is uh, Kentucky Pride. To my right is Dixie. And if you were to make an evaluation right now, say, boy, that, that Dixie looks better than the Kentucky Pride. But this is not how we're judging. The, what we're really looking for in a crimson clover is we're trying to extend the range further north. These were spring seeded. The value of the Kentucky Pride variety is in its superior winter hardiness. Crimson clover is not usually spring planted. It's planted in the fall. And unfortunately, as you go farther north, it tends to winter kill. And, uh, enough north to our liking. So we're uh, very excited to have some superior winter hardiness genetics that we can take a look at and just see how far north we can move through. Because it is a very useful winter clover, one of the more winter hardy of the, of the true clovers. And if we can move that even farther north, that'd be better yet. Because crimson clover probably the most beautiful of all the clovers and uh, it's a great pollinator plant one of the very first flowers to bloom in the spring and one of the most beautiful of all the cover crop flowers